and welcome to my fifth video tutorial from 40frog.com. In this tutorial I'll show you how to create a target effector which is really cool Cinema 4D so you can animate thousands of cloned objects following in target. Let's move this. It's very simple and I think it's very cool. And by the way this is a space octopus character that I, I have tutorial about it in YouTube. Create a new file here, create a cube, change the size to 5, um, 2, and 5. And then I want to clone my object, go to MoGraph and select the cloner object here. Drag the cube inside the cloner object. Now you have three cubes in here. Go to the cloner object and under the object tab there is a box called like mode. Change it to grid array and change the counts to 25, 1, and 25. Okay, now we have about 225 objects in here and I'm gonna change the color here so we can see this cloner object a little bit better. Um, of course green and assign this material to the cloner object. Okay, now the next step is um, creating a target effector. Make sure that the cloner object is on. It's selected and then go to MoGraph and create target effector. See immediately everything is following these arrows in here. And if I move these arrows, everything is reacting to that. Okay, now the next step is to create a sphere and that's gonna be my new target object. Create a sphere and this is pretty big. I'm gonna change the radius to like 10 and then go to the target effector. Under the effector tab there is something called target object. Drag the sphere inside the target object field. Now all of these clones are gonna follow this object. Click on sphere and move it. And one more step, going to target effector and under the effector tab, check the repel. And now move the sphere. Very cool. So if you like it, just create your own still images or animation and feel free to share it with us. Again, this is from 40frog.com. And by the way, I have the step-by-step -step tutorial in my site if you want. Thank you and have a nice day.